Hey, so, um, this is late, sorry, um, I was supposed to do it yesterday, but I completely spaced out, and I wasn't sure if it was my turn to vlog, or Paige's turn to vlog, anyway, um, I'm, I'm going to talk about the, the challenge, um, Signe's, uh, challenge to send her stuff. I'm going to send you stuff, Signy. Um, Signy, Signy. Um, I'm going to send you stuff for your wall, or just send you something. Um, and happy birthday, by the way. I know it's really late, but I like to wish you happy birthday. Um, I'm going to answer some questions from last week. Cameron said, how much does camp mean to you, and what has it meant to you? Like, how has it Anyway, um, um, camp is, was a huge part of my year. I would not, like, I was very, 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 very excited to go, and I love all the people at camp. I wish I could have gone to Vermont sometime, but, you know, it's not, I couldn't afford it, and going over there is too far away for me to go. Anyway, camp has meant a lot to me. It's changed me. It's inspired me to start guitar. I'm a more open person because of that. Um, I'm more open to hugging. I'm, it's just opened me up a lot more than I was, I think. And, um, it just opened me up tons. I can't even remember how I was before I went to camp. And I love love all the um, different things that you do at camp. I think it's an amazing place and that if I could go back it would be awesome. I mean, I've outlived it kind of. I mean, not outlived it, but like I've graduated kind of and so I can't go back as a camper, but uh, maybe I could go back as staff eventually, but I might not want to do that anyway. But, like, I really love camp. It's one of my biggest high points of my year, and now that I'm not going, it's, I have to find something else. It has been a huge chunk of my life, and I can't believe that now I have to move on. It's just, it's wonderful that I got to have that experience. Um, okay, questions other than Cameron. Uh, uh, Hannah wanted to know if she can, if she's gonna, if it's a good idea to get that piercing in her eyebrow. Um, I think it's okay. I like that idea. For you. I mean, I wouldn't want that, but, you know, it's fine for you. Um, You and Zara would match. Anyway, um, is that from Jono's challenge? I think I'm doing the challenge. So, questions from me. Uh, what, uh, okay, um, I think I'll do a challenge. Um, Dress up like your favorite character from a book. Like, you don't have to do anything fancy, just kind of, or you could do a book or anything. Just dress up like somebody from a book, from one of your favorite books. That's my challenge. Um, okay, I guess I'm gonna open my eyes now. If you didn't notice, these are my painted eyes, which is for Jono and Zephyr's challenge. So, um, Cameron and, um, Mackenzie question. What's one of your dreams that you are currently involved in pursuing? Um, right now, I'm kind of not in one, but, but I really want to brush up on my guitar, like Zara said, 
although not like her, I'm kind of just more focused on guitar. Um, better at that. Better at guitar. And Mackenzie's question, what's the craziest dream you've ever had? Um, I guess that's what it was. Um, I don't really remember my dreams, but I did have a really weird dream that I can kind of remember. It was, it, I've been dreaming a lot about camp since I got back this last year. And this one ha involved camp stuff. Um, well that's this event. Like, it was sponsored by camp, but I'm not sure where it was. It was kind of in between Vermont and, um, I've seen pictures in Vermont. So, I know kind of what it looks like, but I have never been there. But, um, <coughs> it was crossed between Vermont and Oregon, um, camp. Like, it was a mix between those two. And Grace was there, and Nathan was there, and some other staff. And I was on the staff, like I was on staff. Um, and campers were there, but I had arrived late. Like, I was there late, and the event was shutting down or something. So Nathan decided, it had a lot of Nathan, anyway, um, decided he was going to drive me to my car or something. And, and then we were having this discussion in the car. And and then he dropped me off, and then that's where it ended. It was really weird and kind of bizarre, and I have no idea why the, dr the dream happened. Anyway, that's the only one I can remember, having where I can remember all those details. Um, I know there's another thing besides this. Um, um, Uh, well, oh, I just got a card, um, I sent, I sent off a lot of Valentine's Day cards around Valentine's Day. Some of you are going to probably get them, but some of them, I don't have you guys an address, so, um, I didn't send you one, sorry. I just don't have your address, otherwise I probably would have sent you one. Um, I, but I got a reply from Nicole. And she sent me this really um, cute card from Nicole. Nicole, she sent me this little card. I love sending off stuff to people. If you want me to send you something, um, just let me know, and um, maybe we could, uh, you know, I'll send you something. And I'll be sending you something for me, um, soon. Okay, see you next week. Bye.